Hi friends Namaste Today I am reciting a poem Your time is now a time to be born a time to die The future world composed by my dear honorable friend versatile author poet novelist and many award winners both in writing and as a financial contestant princess brenda mohammed from san fernando trinidad and tobago she is founder of the biggest author group how to write for success she has written 24 books to the date and making continuous effort to serve the mankind through her divine ink she was suffering from a cancer but now she is free from the disease and it encouraged her to write to save the hopeless person the book i am a cancer free is the best selling book by brenda mohammed let me recite her poem which gives a message to follow god who is always right nebu chad nejar had a dream which he was unable to cipher a statue with a head made of fine gold with chest and arms of silver belly and things of bronze and legs of iron displayed its feet combined with iron and clay had nebuchadnezzar amazed a mighty rock smashed the statue's feet causing it to causing it to sway after shattering it to bits the wind blew the bits away the rock covered the earth and nebuchadnezzar awoke he pondered on this dream and his thoughts were provoked magician enchanters sorcerers and astrologers were consulted all scratched their heads and nebuchadnezzar felt insulted because the meaning of this dream was beyond their imagination nebuchadnezzar got mad and ordered their execution daniel a captive from juda offered an explanation that brought nebuchadnezzar great jubilation daniel said that nebuchadnezzar was the head of gold his kingdom was strong and he would be bold but after his kingdom had reached its end an inferior one would rule again yet another would rise after the second had fallen a kingdom of bronze would be the third to have a region third to have region following that kingdom there would be fourth strong as iron the kingdom would crush previous empires it would be divided as clay and iron cannot mix then the kingdom of god would arise in its midst the kingdom of god will be as solid as rock no one can crush it whoever tries will be out of luck the dream was true and it is its meaning was certain the kingdom of god would stand forever unending thank you very much